Hello everyone, Blainsarge here, welcome back to some more Dawn of War 2, playing through the entire campaign on hard. So in the last episode, if you guys missed it, there will be a little link in the top right of your screen, you can go check it out. Uh, what we did is we went down here, took out the last of the orc raiding parties, and the we now figured out that someone is leading these orcs. So we have to find out who it is, and who's, who's behind all these attacks. So without further ado, let's get started. Commander. The time has come to strike at our true enemy. Whoever has been provoking and guiding the Greenskins is holed up at Fellhammer Mine on the outskirts of Argus. We believe that Mech Badzapper, the orc who escaped us when you first arrived on Calderas, is also headed for the mine. You and your squads will drop south of Fellhammer and push north. Strength and firepower will pay greater dividends than stealth. For this reason, Sergeant Cyrus will remain aboard the Armageddon and provide mission support. Alright, so this target is vulnerable to explosives. Alright, so let's just take a look. So Cyrus is not coming down with us on this one. So we're going to take that off and we're going to give this... Uh, you know, do we want to give this to him? Or is there someone else we give... Ah, uh, we can actually give it to him. So I'll call in some artillery support would be very useful. We'll keep the turrets. Uh, we're fine with that. We got grenades, so we don't really need that. Plus, I'd rather take a building and hold it than lose it. Uh, sucks we're not going to get Cyrus. He's one of my favorite characters. Uh, let's see. Uh, nearby enemies. That could be actually nice. I don't know. All right, but I think we are good to go. I just wanted to make sure I brought that artillery. Uh, without further ado, let's get started. Find out who is behind all these attacks. If you do know, and please don't put it in the comment section down below for those who do not know, uh, just in case. All right. I'm honestly not a fan of Tidius, Tidius, whatever his name, the Assault Squad. I never really use them. Unless they get Terminator armor, then maybe, yeah. But, no. I prefer to keep the enemy at range or use my force commander. Uh-oh. Boom! <laughs> What's that in the sky? Wham! <laughs> Let's call it something to hit you in the forehead. Okay, so let's prepare. Put you guys there. Force commander over there. Tactical squad. Get right here. Get in there, get in there. There we go. Tactical squad moving. Move north up the valley, Commander. Get to Fellhammer Mine and find out who is stirring up the orcs. Uh, okay, so we're gonna have to move up this way. Uh, so obviously, <clears throat> we don't get to really pick where we want to go. Obviously, we can't go over here, so we're kind of pointed in this direction, obviously. Uh, so, let's do it. Everybody go on Tactical Squad. Let's get you moving. Understood. Going there now. Movement on the ridge. Gone. But those were no orcs. Yep. Here comes the Eldar. Ha, 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 ha. Eldar are fun to fight against, in my personal opinion. But not... My most favorite race to take on in this game. The orcs slaughtered them. Ouch. Will avenge them. Keep moving. These poor guardsmen never stood a chance. And our battle brothers too. Yeesh. Our weapons are ready. Reposition. All right, let's move up slowly. Orc gunners on the ridge. Get to cover. Fury from the sky! Cut them down! There you go. Sergeant Thaddeus, reporting for duty, Commander. Did you have a pleasant rest? Waiting for the most dramatic moment to strike? <laughs> Good to see you too, Avatus. Put you guys there, tactical squad. Put you there. Oh, 
Ooh, yeah. There is a communications array nearby that we should secure for the chapter. Strategic assets like these grant us combat advantages and allow us to more easily reinforce in the field. I will run a scan on their defenses. Commander, the orcs are well entrenched at the main entrance. A frontal assault would be unwise. A jump, some grenades, and we're in, Cyrus. And right in the sights of the whole orc horde. All right. Let's grab that. Okay. Uh, let's get you guys right here. You let's get you running forward. Assault squad ready. Grab that. Strike hard and true. Target destroyed. Alright, we're not doing too bad. Alright, you push up. There we go. Captain Squad, move up. You guys go after them. There you go, that's how it's done. Capture this post, so I believe will give us more artillery. Repositioning area Excellent, Commander. Yep, this now we have three. Will provide us with valuable combat intelligence and future operations. And artillery. Fellhammer mine is close by, Commander. All right, so this is gonna be a very, very short mission. Uh, but here we go. We gotta go in there. So let's take it a little bit at a time. Make sure we don't run into any trouble. Move up. Okay. Alright, let's go, guys. You guys move up now. Nothing. Advance. Move up. Tactical reposition. Ready for order. Trouble. These are the orc guards killed where they stood. Someone else has gone through here. Swiftly. Yep. Before the humans arrive. Oh, gee. Allow one obstinate orc to derail the Pontius plan. You didn't know it was Eldar before. You do now. So let's get in there. The Kill those Eldar before they escape. Push up, boys. Push up. All right. What are you doing, brother? This way. Show us strength. Weapons ready. Come in range. I dare you. Big splash. Captured that.
Yeah, I think it's time to call in artillery. <laughs> yeah! Run, you cowards! Alright, let's get up here. Tactical squad, slowly push up. Pop a grenade. Yeah, so much for your advanced technical superiority. Right, let's go after those. Okay. We're doing we're doing all right. Saw squad be ready. Yeah. I'll give the other that. They're not easy targets. They're very, 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 very t uh, skinny. It's hard to hit something so skinny and moving really fast. Okay, so. Let's deploy the turrets. So they will be coming after us here in a minute. Okay. Ready. Let's go up and pop a grenade. Beginning tactical advance. Zenos. Yeah. Zenos. Yep. Pop a grenade in that building. With me, brothers, hostiles purged. This is Abigail. So where's our Farseer? Or whatever the thing is. Yeah. Mowing him down. Alright, you guys go back and get another battle, brother. Before the attack. Here they come. Jeez. Tough little bugger, isn't he? Feel the force of a disciplined mind. Okay. Oh crap. Okay, uh squad ready. You go up there, rescue him. <coughs> Alright, and let's drop some artillery right there. Yeah, he don't like artillery much, does he? Yes. The orcs could have slowed them down, given us time. You, you have doomed us all. Grant all you wish, Eldar. We stand, and you have fallen. The mine is secure, and the Eldar are dead. But the orc leader escaped in the chaos. Understood. Prepare for extraction. Their All right. Will long be How do we do? I didn't kill everybody? Are you kidding me? There was nothing left. All right. Oh, come on. Oh, so close. Don't care about him, though. This is a grave development, Commander. The Eldar are evidently provoking and influencing the Orcs. Their involvement is hardly good news. They claim to be stirring up the Orcs to combat a common threat. What could that be? I would not put much stock in what the Eldar say. They are deceitful and manipulative by nature. That they are, Tarkas, but the Eldar aren't fools. The warlock you defeated may have been guiding the Orcs here on Calderas, but he was only one part of a larger plan. We are receiving reports that the Eldar are stirring up the orcs on the nearby Typhon system. 
Me All right. Armageddon will take you to Typhon, so you can engage the enemy there. I will relay all the stress signals we receive from Typhon back to you. So the Eldar are stirring up, uh, stirring up the orcs for a common enemy. What could that be? <gasps> dun, dun, dun. I know what it is, but I'm, I'm just saying that. Uh, Dance versus orcs. I mean, that, that's a really nice chainsaw. We're going we're gonna to take that. So we're fighting orcs right now, so might as well take that. And then if we take this as well. Hang on. Yeah, less range damage. Uh, nah, I, th I think we'll stick with that pistol. Uh, what is this? More health. Mm, no. What do we want? Let's give him more health. I just don't want him to go down so easily. And for you, just give you the leftover. And that, might as well. Because after that, I really don't care. <laughs> uh, unlocks ability lashes out at a specific target with explosive, short range melee attack. Sounds nice. Let's grab that. Grab that as well. These guys aren't bad. They're good for breaking up a cluster of units, but after that point, in my opinion, they just be kind of become useless. Um, I got no gear or anything for the. Wait, no, I can't wear the new any armor. Uh, we didn't get anything for you or you. I was looking at the new gun we got. Uh, that's pretty cool, but uh, we might hold on to that. Um, I still have decided if I wanted to go um, <clears throat> fully. Uh, melee. I might just go full melee with my commander. Um, let's go quickly take a look over what's going over on the star map. Commander, this is the Armageddon's navigation display. From here, you can review data on the planets of the Aurelian subsector. You can also order the Armageddon to initiate warp travel to one of these worlds. When you are ready, initiate travel to the Typhon system. All right. So let's head on over. All right, so we're at a new system. And it looks like there's quite a bit going on. But that is going to be the end for today's episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this uh, series in this game as much as I am playing it. And if you guys have any comments, suggestions, or feedback about this game or this episode, let me know in the comment section down below. Also, if you have not already, go check out my Discord. Links for that will be in the description down below. Um, also, if you like to follow the channel and keep up with the channel, hit the bell notification icon to keep up when I'm uploading videos. Also, follow me over on my Discord, Discord as well as my Twitter. Links for those will be in the description down below. Um, also, I'd like to take a moment to say thank you to my Patreon supporters. Thank you guys so much for going the extra mile to help support the channel. It really means a lot to me. Till next time, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care, guys. Remember, have an awesome day.